Hello everybody, what is up? This is Eartha Baca coming to you in live streaming on my wall. Uh, what is today? Happy Tuesday! <laughs> I have been sick, you can hear it in my voice, so you haven't been seeing a whole lot of me live because um, most of my live has been trying to stay alive in bed. <laughs> So I'm just going to get in here real quick, and um, I caught the Ebola. <laughs> first time she got it, first week of school, came home, then he, he missed all last week because he was sick too. So I'm going to talk to you today and just get through. I just took an awesome nap. Um, you know what, though? You're never too sick for 5 o'clock. <laughs> Actually, I'm not like fevery sick or anything, so it's not weird. I'm just got the residuals, you know what I mean? Like, like grab the Mucinex kind of residuals. So here you go. Cheers, everybody. Where are you from today? Give me a shout. If you jumped on, let me know where you're from. I'd love to just go, hey, LA in the house. I see Stacy. What's up? I know she's from Arizona. What's up, Madison? Thanks for jumping on. I'm going to show you guys what a custom palette means and what mine is starting to look like. So I'm really excited. Thank you for the heart. Um, hi, Margie. Hi, Vanessa. Okay, guys. Oh, someone said, someone said cheers, I think. I see a cheers. Cheers, girl! <laughs> oh, you guys, guess what I learned? This, it means, what do you think this means? Give me a shout. What do you think this means? Right? When someone's like this, what does it mean, right? Don't be shy. Don't be shy. What does this mean? Hey, hey, Gail. What's up, Gail? Thank you for putting me in the, the bath bomb soap group. I'm so excited. Um, I asked Gail, you guys, you guys, I asked Gail to be in the group because I was struggling with my bath bombs and she's awesome. I found her on YouTube, so go find her. Gail, can you give a shout your YouTube channel in the comments so people can find you? Um, I joined her group. I, I also joined an advanced bath bomb group because I was trying to find out a replacement for SLSA because of palm oil. And so Gail was just so sweet and she actually like messaged me privately too. So I was just like, I love this lady. <laughs> so Gail, give a shout, put, uh, drop your YouTube channel so that we can um, support you too, give you likes and subscribes and, and help assist out. So you guys, today we're going to talk about um, what is a custom palette. So first, let me do my thing because look what a difference a little color can make, you know? Like seriously, I barely have mascara on. And one of my favorite things ever is lip gloss. This lip gloss is my favorite because it's actually a wrinkle reducer too. It has squalene in it. Holla. <laughs> okay, so let's get to it. This is what my palette is starting to look like. Okay, this is a customizable palette. Um, I asked you guys a question if you preferred a clear. Hi, I see Stacy. <laughs> So if you preferred a clear palette or if you preferred a palette that actually comes with a mirror, such as our smaller palettes, right? There's the mirror. Okay, see the palette? See my phone? See how I just tape it, you guys, to a, a tripod? That's how I do this. Okay, tape it to the tripod because, yes, knowing me and Shanji running back and forth, we bump into it, my phone would have fallen a billion times. So, girlfriend, tape is your best friend, all right? Live in life la vida loca. <laughs> Oh, thank you. Thank you, Gail. She put her YouTube up there. You guys, go check out her, her YouTube channel. She's the bomb. She's the bath bomb. <laughs> she's awesome. And she's just super cool. Okay, so here's what this is. Um, these are single colors. I'm going to show you my new ones, too. I'm going to open them with you. I'm going to put them in here. And this is what this is magnetic. And these are eyeshadows, super duper pigmented. And they're in like a little tin. So they stick. Okay, so they stick. They don't fall out. They literally stick. And you can, like, say you're going to do a certain combo for the day, and you can actually just kind of arrange them if you want, if that helps you, like, stay on track. Or if you're going to do um, a demo and you want to keep your colors in your order, whatever you want to do, okay? Or you can literally just, like, you know, get them all monochromatic, have fun, um, shimmers to shimmers, satins to mattes, whatever you want to do. The cool thing about it is that you have a customizable palette. Now, why is that the bomb diggity bomb sauce? Okay, I have all six of these, but I brought three of them to show you. These are the three that I use the most, okay? Of the addiction palettes, they have, they have one, two, three, four, five, six. They have seven beautiful colors in each one, right? But check this out. I, this one and three are my go-tos. These are my go-to palettes for this color and for this color 
and for this color. So out of the seven, my go-to colors are only three out of the seven. Okay, they're still there. I've still used them, but nothing like I do for my regulars, not only. So here's my palette three. These, this is my go-to. Tickled, that's a transition color. This is my go-to um, Smitten because it's a beautiful highlight. See that? You guys can see the shimmer. I use it for the inner corner. I use these a little bit. I use this for a little bit of cat wings sometimes. So, but I barely touch the other colors. So what's happening is I have these beautiful palettes with colors that I love, that I use, but I don't use them all, okay? Here's another beautiful palette. I love this palette. This is number two. Again, there's six palettes. I'm showing you one, two, and three. Um, you know, I've, I've really loved this shimmer color here, but for the most part, I have barely touched these, right? And then if you notice this color here, which is dark black, I'm blind. So, oh, it's called Peppy. Look at this. <laughs> Peppy is almost identical to the other black in my other palette. So, you seeing this? So, now I have two similar shades. So, here's what's happening. I love these palettes, and before our singles came out, I was actually going to go shop for some at Sephora, at Ulta, because I needed some more single colors, such as these bright beautiful colors that were not in our our catalog so guess what just before I was about to go do that my company comes out wham bam with all these new products including palettes this is not the unique palette but it they came out with a magnetic palette which sold out in like two seconds so if you guys want to grab yours it comes um, with 25 slots 25 not slots but a 25 space area and it has a mirror and it's branded so it's super cute it's black um, I liked this because this is why. This is why I chose this when I bought this one. I liked the see-through because of this. I'm at home now with six of these palettes, right? And they stack like this. So now when I want to get at one, I'm over here opening. Oh, that's that. Oh, that's that. Oh, it's like I'm wasting all this time when I could just look right through the clear top and go, okay, those are the colors I want to use. But that being said... I've got a whole um, different idea, too, for when I want to travel. So this is where the quad comes in. This is a really cool little quad compact where you actually stick the singles right in. It is really made well. The construction is awesome. It's not like that cheap plastic stuff where if you drop it, your shadows break. Like, how annoying. If they break, I have a way to help you. I'm really big into DIY, <laughs> as you guys know. So let's just give an example. Let's grab this beautiful color, Fervent. This is actually the color of the season. It's gorgeous. On every eye color, this color, Fervent, is gorgeous. So here's how you do this. Say your color combination today is going to be Fervent. You just pop that in. And um, I did a little demo of this in my first episode of Beauty Graffiti to demonstrate for you how if you are going to go like from daytime to uh, nighttime, and say you're not going to go home necessarily and you want to just kind of touch up your makeup. Grab your singles, pop them in your quad, throw it in your purse with like your crease brush, your primer, um, some setting spray. And you are good to go, right? So check this out. How do you get them out? They're magnetic. Like, how, what are you supposed to do? Well, right on the back, there's a little hole and you take a little, a little pen and just open it and pop that right there. Which I should have brought a pen with me and I just forgot. And then you just grab it and take it out. Simple, easy, safe, easy to travel with. So you don't have to take this everywhere you go. I don't have to take all three palettes with me everywhere I go if I'm just going to use one or two colors from each one. Okay? So that's the genius of customizing your palette. Also, it saves you money and time because you are not paying, again, $49 for a palette that you're using one color the most of you can see I use it a lot and hardly barely I barely 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 so for me it's not wasted money because I love having all these colors but I do art looks too and I'm a makeup artist so to have a lot of makeup in different colors like like gives me the feels you know what I'm saying just gives me the feels <laughs> so this is what happens when you guys buy a single these are called the refills if you buy a single compact it's actually going to come with um the same little thing like this, but it's a single. You're going to get one of these, and it's going to be a single square, and it's going to have a little magnetic closure with a little brand, and it's going to be really, really cool. Thank you for my hearts. Thank you, guys. <coughs> before I stop and say, um, before I open the colors, I'm going to show these to you. I'm really excited about these four colors, you guys. Um, 
I have to say hi. Give me a shout where you're from. So, hey, Urbana, what's up? Hi, Vanessa. Yes, the magnetic idea is bomb, girlfriend. Bomb. So, um, there's a thing called Z palettes too. You can get on Amazon and they're like, I think I want to say $20, $25. Um, the, and they're clear is what I understand. Um, this is not a Z palette. This is not the unique palette. The unique empty palette is 25 slots. I believe it's $25 and it has a mirror and it's well super made. It's not that cheap plasticky stuff that you get with like cheap, not even, I would say overpriced. Some, some makeup is overpriced. Like you could, I won't name the brands, but you'll get some cheesy little case and you just feel like, okay, am I really buying something quality? Kind of question it, you know, but this is made so well. So I really love it and it protects your makeup. So let me say hi to you guys before I move on. Um, yes, that is so awesome. And Gail's from Massachusetts. What's up? Hey, Lori. Thanks for being here. I know Lori's a local. She's a, the mama of one of my good friends. So, hey, Lori, what's happening, girl? Um, let's see. Uh, let's see. See, Stacy. she said, I love that we have single press shadows now. Yes. And Gail's like me, too. Great idea. That's cute. Awesome. You guys are rocking the house. What's up, Tara? Hi, Anna. I think I got everybody now. Okay, you guys, um, give me some love. Let me know you're here. Let's open these new awesome colors because um, I'm working on my repertoire. Okay, this color is so gorgeous. I love it. I chose a mix between um, shimmer, matte, and satin finishes because each one will give you a different finish. And I, I dropped a little sticker. I'll, I'll show you the other one and the next one. Look at this beautiful shimmery rose gold. It's like a rosy pink, I should say. So pretty. Let's take it out. So this is what you can expect when you get it. Your single pressed powder eyeshadow. You can expect it to be in a little tin. There's a lot of product in there. This is going to last you forever. I mean, like literally our, our pigments are so pigmented. It's insane. So I'm super excited to add it. I think I'll just put this bad boy right there just like that. Cause that's going to be really pretty. I'm just going to start adding it. I should have brought a pen. I wonder if, if Shanji could hear me if I give him a shout. <laughs> hey Shanji. Can you bring Mama a pen, please, for my desk? Thank you, love. All right. This color. Thank you. I appreciate it. This is color. Awesome. This is a beautiful color. Why this color? Um, when you choose a color of the earth, which I love these earth tones, you're choosing transition colors, um, maybe an overall um, eyelid color. You're choosing the colors of the earth. That's a beautiful matte color. Thank you, my love. I appreciate that. You're so sweet. Aww. He did it. <laughs> He's actually really sweet. He just gets in moods like every other toddler. Is he really a toddler? You guys, what do, you, what do I call him now? He's five years old. He's not a baby. He's not a toddler. He's not really a kid yet till like you're six. So at five is like the really weirdest thing. I don't know to say toddler. I just call him my son. <laughs> so here we go. I'm adding colors now to my customizable palette. Um, these two colors, holy shamoles, guac a freaking moly. Okay. Yeah. Oh my God. Look at this blue. Oh my God. I am loving this color. And this is what I keep dropping as I open it. So let me just not drop it this time. Your little colors come with a sticker so that you can actually on the back side of your, uh, compact, not have to do the shenanigans I told you about. You can actually put your sticker on the back and know what you're going to be looking at. Okay. Before you open it, you can do that if you like, but I changed mine a lot. So I don't use the stickers. So let's get this open. Oh my God. <laughs> this color, I just was flipping over. Oh my God. And with blue eyes, blue on blue is like, you don't want to do that because it washes you out, but boom, not this one. This actually makes my eyes look green. Holy freaking moly, dude. Oh my God. I cannot wait to use that. All right, you guys, how do you get the colors to pop and be gorgeous? You use your primer for sure. If you're not using your primer, your, your colors are going to look dull. You will not get this. It's going to look like some washed out blue. And all that excitement I had just right now is going to be like, wah, 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 whoop, whoop, right? That's what's going to happen without primer. So use your primer. And to get the best, 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 best pop, you want to actually use a concealer underneath that's light or actually go on with a white liner and go white first and then top with your pop color, okay? So you do this with like a bright yellow, a bright blue, a, just anything that's just Shazam, okay? If you want a Shazam, you gotta give yourself a base of a light color, not just your your uh, skin tone. Definitely not just like over a color like this. this. Oh my God, that's so pretty. This is this beautiful orangey apricot. You guys, I'm gonna hold this next to my eyes. You're gonna see how 
fire this is on blue eyes and every eye color on brown oh my god the green blue hazel oh my god look at this freaking color holy cow so do you see how some colors make my eyes look more green some colors make my eyes look more blue because what color does is it actually reflects the light off of so if I'm wearing like a bluer or greener shirt my eyes are gonna look a little bit greener because this is kind of a green but if I wear like a bright royal blue shirt my eyes look like blue as the sky even gray so using opposite colors of the color wheel and your eye color is how you will choose the best color for you so if you're not sure I'm absolutely here to help you guys please definitely um, send me a message and say Eartha okay I have brown eyes and this is generally what I use. I have a brown, I have a black, I have a white, I have a, a orangey color. What should I add? Okay, so let's just chat. Let's just see what's right for you. Building that color palette. Holy cow. This color here, oh, that I put in. I'm going to take them out now with my pen. So this is the compact. Okay, now I want to take them out. I want to show you how easy it is because if you don't know this trick, you're probably like going to go, what? Grab a pen. Remember there's a little hole back here? So you're just going to stick it in the little hole and see how that pops that out just a little bit. See that? Gives a little pop. I'm going to grab it with my finger. Super easy. Not messy. Not like I'm going to drop it. <laughs> this color I use almost with all my eye looks because it pops the color. This is like a, a gold shimmer metallic. And I use my finger because you want to have a, a warm finger to really get the pigment and actually push and press. So we're not brushing. I only do that when I'm blending. This beautiful, beautiful color is fire on every eye color as a center lid shimmer pop. Oh my God, you guys. This color right here. What's it called? Fanatical. <laughs> oh, by the way, if you guys don't know if this is your first live with me, let me know. Say, hey, it's my first time with you. And I'm blind. <laughs> so every time I look up close without my glasses, I'm like this. All right, so that's that. I'm going to actually fill up my palette real quick just with the last three colors so you guys can see what is happening here. Look at these opposite of the color wheel colors, okay? So these colors are going to be fire together. All right, I would actually, if I was doing an eye look, I would actually use, yeah, I would use this kind of a combo. And then I would use like a dark on the lash line. <coughs> so let's get my other colors back in there so you can see what's going on. And this is why I chose these two for my eye color. Um, my eye shape, I have hooded eyes. So um, I don't use a lot of shimmers. I use more mattes and satins. And when I use a shimmer, it's on the center lid to pop that, that color and also on the inner corner. And the inner corner shimmer is going to be more like a white or an eggshell color or like this color optimistic, but that's not a shimmer. So this is why I still love having my palettes because I am going to go back to this beautiful shimmer color here. Use my finger and do a little pop. Let me demonstrate that for you. Using the heat of your finger, it shows up more than if I were to use a brush. Okay, that's a makeup artist tip. Okay, so that's going to look really funny on me now. Let me just... Why not? <laughs> Man, this cold ain't no joke. Okay, this color here is um, a color I use for an overall um, overall color when I'm setting my concealer. If I do a look where I'm um, really cutting out my eyebrows and I use a concealer, you want to set that. And so what you need to do is do an overall color that is really similar to your skin tone so this color for me is very similar I use it as an overall color so this for me is a necessity it's a go-to see how it's a little bit tan and it is matte it is it's called timid it's not shimmery you don't want to use a shimmer for that you want to use a matte for that okay so we're adding one more I've got one more slot to fill after I do this um, we have this bright yellow that I'm excited about it is a shimmer though and I think it's really similar to my gold that I already have. So I'm I'm on the fence. <laughs> do I want to have a shade that's slightly different? Or do I want to actually go out and get a, a real like bright fluorescent yellow? Adding fervent to the palette. Now you can see all of these colors I chose for my blue eyes. All of these colors look beautiful on blue eyes. So I don't have any wasted real estate. I don't have any wasted space. I've got no wasted money. 
and I'm super happy that I have options. I can throw four of them in my quad. If I did a black liner, I have the single that I talked about. I can just grab this, throw it in my purse, and just touch it up as you know the day goes on if I want. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So that is what it means to have a customizable palette. Um, I have a free mascara for you guys when you do grab your quad and your Splash Liquid Lipstick. So you get to choose your Splash Liquid Lipstick color. You get to choose your four colors in your quad. And I'm giving you a little bit of a discount on that as well as a free Epic Mascara. So if you guys want to take that deal to heart, um, the, the post I did just below earlier today is in my story. So go to my story. I posted that I have something free for you guys for anybody who jumps on my site, grabs anything of any size, put that order in, and I'm giving you that thing that I can't mention publicly free. Okay, so go to my story. You'll see Earth the Baca. Go look. What are you talking about? Is that purple post? Oh, no, no. It's white on my story. It's just the, the writing goes, look at what I'm giving you free. Um, I've been talking to a couple people, and they haven't actually had the time yet to get online. So do it now because I'm giving that to you free. And a free mascara. Ah, I'm so excited. Um, the Epic Mascara is bomb, you guys. The polymers, the, just the, the everything about it, it's called Epic for a reason. And I'm um, actually... I slept and took a nap through this, so don't sleep in your makeup. I did. Well, it's not really my makeup. It's my my <laughs> mascara, but I sleep kind of on my back. If you go sleep like this way or on your face, ooh, girl, that's so bad. Don't do that. All right, um, I'm out of here. Thank you guys so much. I'm going to say hello to you before I go because I see more people had jumped on with me, so thank you. Hi, Natalie. Oh, my gosh. What's up, girl? Hi, Vicky. Hi, Kimberly. Hey, hey. Um, and let's see. Uh... All right, all right, we got you all, you guys. Thank you so much for being here. If you're watching the replay, <coughs> Lord have mercy. <laughs> Cheers. Um, give me a shout where you're from, and definitely grab something from my site today because it comes with that free thing. If you want to grab what I showed you today, it comes with a free Epic Mascara, and I even took a little bit of discount off that Splash Liquid Lipstick and that Quad, just for you. Just for you, because I love you. <laughs> it's fun, you guys. Makeup is just fun. Like, obviously, I don't live in my makeup. Half, no, 75% of the pictures you see me on Facebook are this. I'm going to Zumba, or I'm just working. Hair up, mascara, and lip gloss or bonbons on my lips. When I go full makeup, though, girl, I want choices. If you work daily in, in an office and you just have to wear some makeup now, now and again, or just very simple, you know, customize something. Don't go spend your money. You work hard for that money, okay? Don't spend money on a palette that you love the three or four or two or one color of, but you never touch these other colors. Like I've seen glitter palettes, they call them mermaid palettes, or glitter, 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 glitter. I'm like, but if you wouldn't use the purple glitter or the black glitter or the the, I don't know, called the blue glitter, why, you know, you're going to waste your money because you loved the yellow, the orange, and the red instead. And now you don't even use these colors. So anyway, with this customizable palette, every color is hand chosen. Oh, it's like your little pet. You can pet it. <laughs> good palette. Good palette. <laughs> don't you have to go take it out. Don't you have to go walk your palette and you deal with all the mess. <laughs> it's the best pet ever. Pet palettes. Oh my God. I, what, what kind of business am I in where I'm discovering new, new things? My, this is my new pet palette. Welcome to Pet Palette Palace. How may I help you? <laughs> oh my God. Okay, you guys. Have a great night. Thanks for jumping on. Um, catch my Graffiti Beauty live show, which is not as silly. It's more, it's more of a show, more information. I'm going to show you how to do highlights and I'm going to show you how to sculpt your nose into any shape, no matter what shape of nose you have, how to really easily sculpt your nose into those beautiful noses that you see. Oh, she was just born with it? No, nope. it was sculpting and highlight. I'm gonna show you how to do it. It is on my fan page. That is the link that you're probably seeing on this side or this side in that little bio area where it says Beauty Graffiti Live at Eartha Baca. Click that. Go click like, follow, see first, and make sure you're over there because I do have prizes and giveaways on every show from now on. Episode 2 Friday, whoop whoop, 12 o'clock p.m. PSD. Oh my gosh, I have to switch it to this. I forgot to tell you guys, in the beginning when I said you guys know what this means, you're going to die, you're going to die, you're going to die. Okay, true story. I'm on Instagram, right? And I always was like, 
like peace, 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 right? I grew up like born in the 70s. Every picture with my mom and family was like peace, right? And so I did this and, and one girl was like, do you know what that means? And I'm like, it means peace, right? Okay, now I'm, I'm like 46 years old at that point. Um, 47 now, okay? So anyway, no, I was like 45. Yeah, it was a couple years ago. I was like, oh my God. I never knew this in my whole life. She's from Australia and she let me know that this does not mean peace. <laughs> It actually means a really bad word. It's the F-bomb, okay? So if you do this to somebody who is from Australia, she let me know. It's basically the F-bomb. So there you go. It's good to know. Everything now is, what's up? <laughs> so just keep that in mind if you're into social media that uh, every culture has a different take on some different things that we just might take, you know, like, yeah, peace, love, happiness. No, it's like F-bomb, love, and happiness. <laughs> Okay, guys, take care. Have a great day. Thanks for jumping on. I'll talk to you later, and I will definitely see you Friday, 12 p.m. PST on Beauty Graffiti Live with learning some highlight and how to sculpt that nose. Take care. Bye.